Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mar. I am a dental student and today's video is going to be about the life of a broke college student, me. I decided to make this video because I actually, ironically, booked a trip to Boracay last night at midnight. I'm going to go on a trip with my friends in about three weeks and I suddenly realized that damn, I need to save money so that I can have pocket money for the trip. I mean, I've always been kind of broke. Um, because I'm a student, I don't have a job, I only get an allowance, and I am financially dependent on my parents. Yes, I know it's ironic. How are you able to book a flight if you're broke? Well, I have savings, guys, and I did use my savings on the trip, but obviously I don't want to drain my savings. I am going to try to fully pay for this trip. I'm already 27 years old, and it's already a little bit weird for me anyway that I still live off of an allowance. So let's just not get into that. I get about 3,000 pesos a week in allowance. So with the 3,000 pesos I get a week, I am going to try to spend only a maximum of 1,000 pesos a week. Just don't leave the house, Maritza. Hey guys, okay, spending update. I forgot to count yesterday that I spent 50 pesos on my parking for F45. And right now I'm actually leaving F45 again. So I'm about to pay 50 pesos for parking, but I also bought Starbucks, okay? And then the peer pressure ako. The routine kasi is normally after class, I leave with my two friends. Like we walk down to our cars together and they usually stop by Starbucks and I was like, damn, they have my favorite drink, which is now the brown sugar soy ice shake and espresso. So I was just like, damn, okay, I need it. So I ended up spending 190. So my total so far is 290 pesos for the week and it's only Tuesday. I did a little grocery shopping. Luckily, groceries don't come out of my own pocket. Luckily, my mother, who I am still financially dependent on, and father do pay for my groceries. So I decided I'm gonna do a little haul of what I bought. Let's get to it, shall we? The light sucks. These are the things I bought at the supermarket. Some more rolled oats, almond milk, two boxes to be specific, some romaine lettuce, parsley. This goes with my grain salad. I found really cute microgreens and baby kale. I really like this brand or this company called Future Fresh. They do like urban farming. I believe it's like hydroponic farming and it's more sustainable and it's just really great practice all around. I also bought more pasta. This is my favorite. More salad dressing. This is also my favorite. Don't add me if it's not the healthiest, but it's delicious. Some fresh mushrooms. This will go with my pesto pasta. I bought bottled pesto. Like I said, I am a lazy cook, so I do not make my own pesto. And then I also bought some haagen cookies and cream ice cream, because I thought, why not treat myself sometimes? And then I bought these two super cute, the Korean fish ice cream. Okay, I've had this strawberry one, but I have not tried this green tea, and I'm guessing that's red bean. I got some ice cream cones. Lastly, salmon. I don't want to show you, it's gross. Success, success, health as well. So as part of my effort to be more budget friendly, I am currently making my own dinner. I'm just gonna make some pesto pasta with these mushrooms, garlic. It is currently only 4.20 p.m. but I'm hungry. I'm going to transfer the pasta onto this pan. And don't worry about the pasta water getting in there because actually you want the pasta water because it makes for a rich sauce. Open up the jar of pesto and then I'm also gonna take out some of the... There we go. Yum yum! And just clean out the spoon. Yummy. Okay. Just mix the pesto in. Now, you're probably gonna wonder, well, you added water, now it's a little bit soupy. Yes, it is, but you can leave it on the heat for a little bit, and then um, it's just gonna reduce, I guess, and it's gonna become more creamy than watery. A little bit more salt, because I didn't really put too much salt earlier with the mushrooms. Like, the lusciousness of this sauce. Look at the deliciousness and the, like, silkiness of the sauce with the pasta water. 
Um, I think I can even just slide this. There's no design in this, guys. I'm just eating this like right away. Honestly, if I could, I'd probably eat it off the pan. Yeah, I always like to have a little lemon. So I never cut my lemons into like circles or half circles. So I always say like, cut out a wedge in them just so that I can still save them and not waste the lemon. Lemons are expensive. So I'm just gonna cut another wedge. Ta-da. I have a bowl of salad with kale and lettuce and then a bowl of pasta. And now we're on our way to my cousin's house. This is actually Valerie, by the way. Who named her Aiko in the first place? Aiko. Well, actually, mom came up with her name. Because Aiko in Japanese apparently means something like little love. Aww. Isn't it so cute? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Queef is my cousin's golden retriever. <laughs> they live in the beach now, by the way. But anyway, I was wondering why they called him Queef. So now I know what queef is. <laughs> Vaginal flatulence. Huh? Every day. Mark, your mom's struggling. <laughs> I don't think I should be including that in the vlog. <laughs> okay, I'm in my cousin's house. I brought the doggies over for a doggy play date. My, my mom is really very happy. Oh, this is Moon. Puppies! <laughs> you wanna see a haul? Yes! Puppy haul! Oh my god, look at this! Woohoo! This is for his food bags. Oh, cute! And it's also sanitizer. Wow, premium! This is the sanitizer. Ooh, salt and pepper milk! Oh yeah, smile cute. Not sponsored. Not sponsored, not an ad. We don't even know if it really works. I know. <laughs> oh, okay, oh my god, guys, look at this. Another Shopee find. This is a dog hair brush. Then you push the button and then look. Then it comes out. Try it though. Yeah, let's try. Oh, my child. Okay, okay. stay here now. This Sit. Is... Good girl. It's oh. a hair brush. And this is for us. This is the toothbrush. Yes, I do also. She seems to be fine with this brush. You guys have the same hair problems now. Frizz. Me and I go, yeah. Frizz. Frizz and puff. Curly hair life. Okay, here we go. So now we have some fur on the brush. There. Okay, we're gonna push this out now. <gasps> Where's Moon? Ah, a revelation. Right? It's so easy. $6. This is amazing. How much is this? One hundred fifty. The brand says it's a scanny. Yeah. <laughs> All of these. We oh, yeah. got a glass straw. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we have and three straws. Yeah, it comes with three and a cleaner. Yes, this is actually a test tube brush. Yeah, I know. And then now we have the silicone massage bath brush. You put the shampoo in here, and then this is a uh, cheese. Like it looks like a protein, like a shaker, because it has like two lids, like one here, and then another lid here. Ow. And there's like two, it's split in the middle. One side is like for liquid and the other side is for food. So, oh, and then, what is that, Aj? It's for, for cleaning their paws. You can put water and a little bit of soap, wash it in here, yeah. in the paws. It's yeah. not really soft. Yeah. And then it's super easy to clean because look, ta-da, you just take it out. Okay. Amazing! <laughs> Let's test it out on Aiko. Friend, this is a friend, okay? This is a friend. 
<laughs> Wait, where's the zoom in this thing? It's like, oh, she's actually letting me put it inside. Like, she's it's just limp. <laughs> I think you know what I'm thinking about. This. I know. I know. It's not very love friendly. That's 1,000 for a thank you. All right. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Bye. No, but yeah, this is a really good idea for pause. <laughs> <laughs> you should see her. She just dragged it in the house. Do you already? Your mom already ate I'm not bringing any home. I have to be losing weight. I'm going to Barakai. Okay, so we came from like a meeting. Technically, it was Rashi Valerie and Auntie Stephanie because they have. Ah, I'm gonna plug V Organics. Yeah. They make honestly the best VCO. I think I talked about how. Oh no, I never did. But anyway, I have skin asthma and I don't even use. I started using lotions and stuff, but then I'd still need the ointment because I would still get flare ups. Then since I started using their VCO in particular, mm -hmm. I haven't had any flare-up since. But anyway, we went to a meeting for some packaging options because they're gonna just business stuff, packaging stuff. And their business actually does the packaging for all these different like known brands of snacks and food products. And one of the products is Tommy. But I was like, oh my god, I love Tommy. And then he sent like three giant bags of these chips. So thank you. You know, guys, I would also have hauls if, first of all, I was earning money either by career, but obviously I'm still in school, so that's just not possible. Support or Ritual Scrub Cap. Oh, yeah, guys. Guys, I have a little um, small Side business hustle. making premium reversible cotton scrub caps. I do talk about it sometimes about how I just hate using bouffant caps. Number one, they're ugly and they're just. They generate so much unnecessary waste, all right? Mm. I'm sure you guys in dental school and even in the profession will know when you look into your garbage cans after a day in the clinic or a day in the lab, they are just like full of bouffant caps, like the disposable ones. So I made some really cute reversible scrub caps. So they're basically two caps in one. They're super comfortable, super cute, and you help the environment as well. And they are sewn in the Philippines. I handpicked all of the fabric, chose all the colors, chose all the prints myself. This is like my passion project. And at the same time, my own way of trying to be a little more self-sufficient or a little more self-reliant as a student. Hmm. Tell me when you want to. So many doggies. Them on walk. I'll put oh, yeah. this stuff in the room and then we can. We just can go on a walk now. Oh, sukiyaki. Oh yeah, this is my second ice cream of the day. This is delicious. It is... I don't know how to read this. Hello, good morning everyone. I'm with Anton, my filmer, my videographer right now, and he's going to be my patient at school. I'm going to clean his teeth. Um, update on my expenses. We are going to be dropping by a McDonald's drive through so... That's gonna be at least 200 pesos for me. Yeah, it might treat. Really? Yeah, why not? Oh my god, okay, so it's gonna be a Todd Street, so okay, never mind. I'm not spending any for anything then this morning. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention also yesterday. So I didn't end up spending on ice cream, but I did buy two shirts and cotton on. <laughs> oh, I failed. <laughs> <laughs> because they were like 600 each or like 1,200 for two shirts I didn't even so, know you were on that 1,000 peso a week thing that was my oh I didn't tell you about it but that was like my goal because I was saying that I need to save money for Bora but then I ended up spending 1,200 in cotton on yesterday so never mind this is a failure <laughs> maybe we'll just as I was trying to say, maybe I'll just try again next week. All right, cut. <laughs> I am already over budget. Go. Okay, since I'm already over budget. Oh, damn it, I forgot that I was gonna say. Okay, like, just when... keep it on. Since I'm already over budget, next week I'll go back to <laughs> trying for, I don't know, 1,000 only. Okay, that's it, cut. McDonald's. I'm gonna bite now. So yummy! So yummy! Not gonna say it's delicious. It's delicious.
delicious. <laughs> Alright, hey guys, so I am home from cleaning Anton's teeth today and we had lunch at home and then we were planning to go out for coffee and to study but then I'm really tired so we didn't push through with it. But anyway, aside from the McDonald's that Anton got me today, he also bought me Starbucks. So I have coffee and this cake, what is this called again? It's like the apple pumpkin something something. It's actually really delicious. So seeing as how I already failed the challenge because of the two shirts I bought yesterday. Maybe I should just close the, the video here and just end it. And then let's just do this again. So yeah guys, that was a fail. Thank you for watching this video. Um, please don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to like this video if you liked it. If you didn't, then whatever. You don't have to like the video. Bye everybody.